girls, today we are doing day nine of unit four for places and faces in communities. And today, Curiosity brought this ball with her. Hmm, I think she might have been playing outside, but where? It was a place in Curiosityville. Hmm, where could you go outside in your community to play? Well, Curiosity was playing at the park in her community. So today we are going to be talking about places in your community where you can go to have fun. So let's think, where are some places in our community where we can go to have fun? Some people like to go to the park or a playground. You can also go to the movies. You can go bowling. Some communities even have a zoo. We also like to come to school because school is a fun place to learn and we can also have fun at the library. So today we're going to watch a video called Going to the Library. There's a special place I know that's not far from you or me. It's a place full of surprises and it's called the library. In the library you will find books of every shape and kind. In the library, the la 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 library. You can read about flying around the world in a balloon. Or find books about people. Stories about things like kings who dance with the fiddlers three. But you can read about kids just like you and me. Yes, in the library, you will find books of every shape and kind. In the library, the la 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 library. There's one in every town. You can borrow books. something is fun, we mean that we really have a great time doing it. These folks are having lots of fun in the park. Okay, let's look over at our daily message to see if our wonderful word fun is in the daily message. Communities have places where we can have fun. Let's listen one more time for the word fun in the daily message. Communities have places where we can have fun. Did you hear the wonderful word fun in the daily message? You sure did. It is the last word in our daily message. Fun. Let's count to see how many words we have in the daily message today. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight words in our daily message. This week we have been working on letter. Do you remember our letter? That's right. It is letter U and U has two sounds. U, 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 uh, uh, uh. So 
let's look to see if we can find letter U in our daily message. Let's look at the word communities. Oh, right there. I'm going to underline it. How about the word have? Nope. Places. No. Where? Not there. How about in the word we? No. Can. No. Have. No. How about in our wonderful word fun? Yes. Letter U is in our wonderful word fun. Right there in the middle. So let's count to see how many times we found the letter U in our daily message. One, two. Two times we found the letter U. Let's go over a couple words that start with U. I say up. You say. I say up, up, up. You say. I say up. You say. I say unicorn. You say. I say you, you, unicorn. You say. I say you, the corn. You say. Good job. The you song. You got a certain shape. You got a certain charm. I feel real cozy when you're in my arms. You, 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 my friend, you. to our math moments to count with curiosity from 1 to 14. I love to count. Let's count to number 14. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. We can count! So Curiosity wants you to help her today, and she wants you to help her count. 
how many bears she has today. So let's pull out some bears. And can you help me count them? One, two, three, four, five. Now as I point to them, you count them. Practice doing this at home with someone in your house. Take out either some of your toys or you can count something in your kitchen and have, a, have someone in your house practice counting with you. Let's watch our video now, five starfish and eels. Remember to choose one to play at today. Thanks for tuning in for day nine of unit four for places and faces and communities. Be sure to tune in for day 10 with Miss Peterson. Bye guys.